Hey, this is Annie Manning with Paint the Moon Photoshop Actions, and today I'm going to show you how to use a batch process with using the Picture Perfect Portrait Mega Set. And a batch process is basically telling Photoshop to process a large batch of images. Or, you know, it could be small or large. You can do hundreds of images at a time. You can do, if you have a dozen images you want to process with the same action at once, it does it all automatically for you. And the actions in the Picture Perfect Portrait Mega set were created to uh, most of them. The, the retouching ones obviously need some input from you, but uh, a lot, most of the workflow actions are created to be batched. And so, um, and there's also going to be, and if you haven't received the update already, there is going to be a separate action set for Photoshop users that have no stops in them. Uh, so that if you don't need those teaching messages that pop up, those are going to be all removed from the second version of the set included. And that also means that those actions can be batched. We're going to go to File, and we're going to go to Automate and Batch. And you'll want to have your folder of images all ready to go that you want the batch to be applied to. You're going to have your action selected here. We're going to play an action from the set Picture Perfect Portrait Mega Set. And the action I want to apply to all of these is going to be clean process on these. And then you're going to go to the source folder, and this is where you tell it where the images are coming from. And so I'm going to choose on my desktop here, I've got my uh, batch sample. and. If you have a folder with subfolders inside it and you want those folders inside the folder included, you can click Include All Subfolders. And then down here, we select the destination folder. And so um, you just want to create a folder or if you have a folder already where these are going to be going to. And I already have one, and it's the batch sample saves. And you can um, tell it exactly how you want the files to be named. I'm just going to leave it at Document Name and Extension. And starting with one and OK. And it's going to pop open all of your images in that folder, apply the action that you told it to apply. And then it's going to pop open Save As, and it wants you to tell it how to save it. So I'm going to save these as JPEGs and hit Save there. And it's going to pop up in the next image, and it's going to go through all of these adjustments on all of the images, it just only stopping. The only input you need to do is just to tell it how you want it to save. And it'll do that. Close it, open the next one, run the action, and so forth through however many images you have in there. Super easy way to breeze through a workflow. And when it's done, you have your originals untouched and your new processed images all saved at however you saved them as in the folder that you told it to. Really easy way to get through a session without a lot of uh, input from you. And like I said, most of the workflow type actions, especially the all-in-ones in the por Picture Perfect Portrait Mega Set are able to be batched like this. And so I'm going to let it do its thing, and I thank you for listening, and I hope this helps speed up your workflow and get you back where you belong taking pictures and doing what you love instead of sitting in front of the computer. I thank you, and I hope you have a wonderful day.